Oh, Murray State, they don't know what to expect necessarily. Definitely. Are yeah. we going to see another Farah? They took out their star Farah player. So now Murray State, interesting position they've been put in. Yeah, we'll see what we'll see what comps that they come out here with. Um, blue team, uh, from what we've seen, isn't really um, kind of a meta playing team. They kind of just play whatever their strengths are, which is a good thing to do in most situations. Um, but sometimes you just need to run that meta uh, meta composition. <clears throat> so Dorado, 20 seconds away from starting. We'll find out. Murray State okay. looks like they have picked early here. A junkrat, interesting. Junkrat pick. Chongrape, okay. we saw him run that in scrims last night. So we'll see if it's good effect here. J Dog, a Mandalorian with that uh, Baptiste and Moira support line and the old classic Zarya Reinhardt tank combination. And there's McCree, I'm Dirty I'm very Paws. excited to see Dirty Paws McCree. I feel like in tryouts, he really popped off as McCree. So hopefully we can see some big high noons and some big kill feed action there. Now, do you think uh, he, is he the kind of player, I don't know how much you know about him, that he would normally play McCree on a map like this? Or is this kind of a counter because they think they may run a, a Farah again? Sure, I think, it's, I think it's probably a little bit of both. Uh, McCree's pretty meta right now anyway. So he's a very strong pick, but also just the fact that um, their Farah um, on, on Elios was so prevalent and so strong. Um, they just need to have a hit scan just in case that there's a Farah. Well, I'm not sure whose birthday it is, but Chongrape is spamming that voice line. So here we go, racers. Five seconds and the doors will open. They are on offense first. Villanova choosing that advantageous uh, first round defense. Funneling out the door, touching the payload early. You'd have to guess now. Villanova up top, and there they are right away engaging. We can see Mandalorian lobbing those healing grenades in as the racers try to get behind this cart and use a little extra cover. Mandalorian checking his back, checking behind him, making sure to watch for the flank. Looks like we may have a Widowmaker on the other team. Fire coming in from up above. Shield work from Dylan, preventing the team from falling. Good heals so far. Stay making solid time right now. This fight is mostly just chipping right now. We're going to see if Villanova commits to dropping on payload. Um, looks like they're really, oh, that may have been low. Um, the fight is going on on payload. Looks like they have dropped it. Uh, but it is a 65. So early pick there. Advantageous for Villanova as the ice wall is going to be hard to get those heals in. Mandalorian needs to hurry. Immortality failed, but the shatter is there. They're going to clean him up. And Villanova pushing Murray State backwards here. Um, I think it was just uh, the supports were slightly out of position there, um, and then they got susceptible uh, with that shatter there. Um, just unlucky, and he's been building shatter super quick. Cool. Seems like that Reinhardt has that shatter almost every team fight, just like that far out uh, barrage every team fight last map. Three minutes, 46 seconds on the clock. Racers once again funneling out. Fire coming in from the top again. Villanova maintaining that position up high, just trying to chip away, like Jacob said, uh, on the racers. Hey, thanks, Dr. Spring with the Tier 1 for subscribing. Shout out to you. Appreciate it. Heels coming in on the Moira. Here we go again. Prolonged team fight for this point, you think? So if we if we brawl out here, the Villanova's definitely going to get the upper hand. She's going to have so much area denial. Murray State needs to try to go in. Oh, but they lose their jump rack. Do you think they need to be more aggressive here? Oh, definitely. They need to, they need to try to press W. While the A does have the wall, they try to bait those out. And then they will be able to clean push in. Um, Dirty Paw's getting some value though, um, but he's oh, all in alone though. Caster's Curse, you're learning it quickly, <laughs> Flopfield. As you call him out, he dies, yep. so Murray State has to regroup, but ults in tow. Uh, We're coming ults. up on a lot of ultimates, five ultimates here. Here we go. Uh, Murray State needs to press Q. <laughs> Get press W and press Q. You only need two keys right now if you're Murray State and your mouse one, and let's just go for it. Here come the racers up the hill. They've pushed the payload to the arc. This is a very tough point to break, especially with that up high flank that they need to be careful of. Like you said, trying to bait out the May Ice while shields up the dirty paws. Here come the racers staying in behind. There's a high new behind him. Immortality field. Oh, what bad timing or unfortunate timing. He he knew he was there and dropped it, but got two. Oh, man. All right, takes the back up now. You have no supports. You cannot do anything here. Murray State's going to try to pressure, though. Yeah. He's just going to try and get some time. Shatter block. Graviton Surge ready to go. He's going to pop it here just to get him back. No, he's going to hold on to it for just a second. Both tanks doing a good job stabilizing and pushing forward here. Villanova not too bothered yet, though. Murray State, they're stabilizing but not pushing forward. They're going to focus on MA. Who's weak? There it is. The Surge, the Graviton, the damage matrix. Murray State doing all the damage. The Deep Bomb's going to back him up, but nobody's going to fall. And Murray State sweeping away Villanova on this point. Murray State does the, ca the classic, just press Q. We used four ultimates there, but we get the point, so it works. And 
plenty of time to push for because Villanova has to run back from so far. So additional time on the clock, and look at that, a shatter ready to go for Dylan. Yes, there's not much to really duo the shatter with besides just follow up. Um, so we're just going to have to shatter early, hopefully. Maybe get that Rhine barrier down on Villanova and then just followed up with um, Moira Damage Orb and uh, some Baptiste damage. Murray State choosing not to be aggressive and keep bodies on the payload instead of sending everybody forward. We'll see if that pays off. The D.Va is just ra racking up the damage from up top as the shields are being chipped away and just trying to get that bomb built back up. And here comes Dylan on the left. He's fire striking. He's trying to get that shatter. He wants it. He's shielding. He's ready for it. He really wants to be there. But he's going to back up. You could tell just the way he was pitching to go in. Now it's, now it's a 5 to 6. This is, this, this is the time. Oh, it's a massive shatter. That's huge. As they get several. Mandalorian as well. Minma, he's going to take away that kill from Dylan. <laughs> but it doesn't matter as Murray State pushes forward again. Great shatter there. Yes, that was a, that was a terrible um, uh, placement by Villanova's D.Va there. She went way too deep to try to get a kill, I assume. Um, and then Murray State just capitalizes. Here we go on the second point, Murray State. They've got enough bodies on the cart. Villanova, if I'm them, if it's me, I may just go ahead and back up and give them this point. But oh, they are pushing forward. Here they go. Oh, oh, oh. Box time checks his watch, and it's high noon, and he gets the triple. Squid and Box time and Minma just keep killing the racers, and that's a team kill. I think we invested Graviton there. We did. Okay. That may have been a desperation ult on the side of our Zarya, um, but we're coming back with four ultimates, it seems like. So maybe we can get um, just a zoning ult of the, the Deadeye and then follow them into a zone, and then we can do the Junkrat tire. See a lot of that Deadeye funneling going on. It's a, a good strategy, and Murray State, speaking of strategies, they're going to continue on this main road. If you're talking to your team, if you're on gold, are you trying to change the point of attack right now with two minutes, 30 seconds on the clock, or are you just going to go forward through the middle? Here? Um, that's the problem with second point on Dorado. There's not a lot of... Uh, right side is slightly effective, but it, again, funnels you in. And especially with the May that uh, Villanova has, you're just going to get walled off. So I think main here is actually a really good call. Um, they're going to zone with the high neutral side of Murray State. Doesn't find it. They use the Deadeye to zone, move to the left-hand side, covering themselves with a Reinhardt shield. This may work out, but there is an anti-grenade. That Reinhardt is low. Thankfully, Mandalorian has the healing grenade. Spamming in on top of him, he's going to go and try and help out. Dirty Paws on the McCree, who survives. JC just needs to wake up from his nap there. And there's the Diva Bomb. I don't know if the shield turned in time. Oh the triple, forward. the quad. It's unbelievable from Squiddo. That was perfect placement. Um, and unlucky that Mandalorian didn't have his lamp. I think he used it just a second ago. Um, so if he had, had, had his lamp there, uh, that would have been able to save the team. At Bad timing a bit from the racers. Decent push so far, but with a minute and a half on the clock, you're running out of options. And... Unfortunately, uh, I'm not sure. Well, we will have a few ults for this last team fight, it looks like, so they might be able to push on okay, so and take the second right point. So we're trying right side here. Okay. I mean, if if Maine hasn't tried two times, at least you're going to try something else, right? Villanova has it ready. Here comes Murray State. They're going to be caught a little bit by surprise. They need to use this in their favor. Diva up top, and there's a blizzard. The mortality field pops to protect, but the nano ride. Minma swinging away as box time, and J-Dub step help as well, and... Man, if you're racers, that is uh, not good. <laughs> yeah, Villanova has just been really good about ulting very Someone's early in fights. Um, it seems like Murray State Blue is just trying to kind of brawl it out, um, but Villanova just says no when they press Q to, to end the team fight super quick. We need to get the payload moving. So it looks like there's a bit of confusion going on. It looks like the racers set this to quick play settings, it looks like they were saying in the chat, which is uh, not good. So they're asking, because it's the racers' fault for setting up the bad lobby, they're saying, or maybe Minma, did they mess up? Who messed uh, up I here? Think I Villanova's think Villanova's it's Villanova. Villanova's lobby? Hosted, yeah. So we'll find out here. Yeah, Squiddo is, yeah. yeah. Minma's, Minma's okay. game. So uh, Villanova messed up here. So it looks like... They said that uh, if you want us to forfeit in this map and give it to you, they'll go to map three. Of course, we're going to take that. I was that, about to so. say, that, <laughs> in my opinion, the map <laughs> wasn't going our way anyway from what it seemed like, so we'll take that. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, thanks to a mistake. Wow. By Villanova, Murray stay back in it one-to-one, -one, <laughs> one and we go to one. Murray map three. <laughs> <laughs> this is some quality Overwatch content we've got going here. <laughs> this is uh, interesting. Wow, 2020. What a comeback. <laughs> off to an interesting start. <laughs> And five-head strategy from yes, the racers, right? Definitely. 
That's wow. I, I don't think that happened to us last season at all. We didn't see that a single time no. last semester. That's just an unluckers on the side of Villanova. Oh, 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 o